I need to learn as a woman to submit to the will of Allah. Look what is this. And this is very famous hadith, which is a Sayyida Aisha, when she went to Hajj with the Rasul alayhi salatu wasalam, her first Hajj with the Rasul alayhi salatu wasalam. And guess what? Before she entered Mecca, she had her period. Al-Qasim, meaning her nephew, he said, Aisha said, my Allah, we set out with the sole intention of performing Hajj, right? And then Rasul alayhi salatu wasalam entered in Saraf. It's a place before Mecca. She was crying, weeping, crying. And he said, Allah, Look, look when the husband understand his wife. He said, what is the matter with you? Have you got your menses? She didn't even say it. And she, and I, she said, yes, of course she cries. She's going for Hajj with the Rasul alayhi salatu wasalam. They, she didn't, she grew up in Mecca. She didn't get to Mecca for, this is almost eight years now or, or nine years. She didn't get to Mecca. Now she is not, she's got, it's exactly like you and me coming from America. My first Hajj, finally, and guess what? I got my cycle. Look what he said. This is something. Allah, I, this is the word, ordained for the daughters of Adam. I have no choice. This is what we need to learn. Submit to the will of Allah. He wanted my cycle to come today. Khalasna, done. I need to learn to submit, not about menstruation also, but about other things happens to my life. I didn't get this. I wanted to do that. I am qualified for this, but I didn't get it. Don't do that. Don't say that. Then you are, you're, you're leaving in the equation. Where is Allah in the equation? I always say this to myself. Well, if I can do everything, then what is the point? Then everybody can do everything. No, there's the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Submit to it, Ramadan. And I don't want to break my fast in Ramadan because it's so hard to make it up later. And you say, hey, guess what? Ramadan, bleeding come in. And you say, Samia'na wa ta'ana. Please learn this word, ladies, all of you, young and old. Samia'na wa ta'ana. I hear and I obey. Train it. Train your tongue. Train your heart. Train your ears before you train your children. That's immediately why you're doing this. Allah said so. Then give me all the explanation. How come you're not upset? Allah ordained it. How come you're sure? Uh, how come you're not sure you're going to do this? Although everything looks like it will. So, because I don't know if Allah will allow it. And that will help you. This will help you to, the least I will say, you will be, you will live in comfort, in peace, peace. Wallah, whatever you do, there is no peace unless you submit to the will of Allah. Khalas. He said, he told me to do this, do it.